Father, we bless you tonight. We'll give you all the glory and praise. We ask that your glory will reign in this place. We need that Shekinah glory. Somebody let your voice and bless the Lord with me. Come on, let's exalt his name together. We bless you, Abba Father. We give you all the glory. Somebody bless him, bless him, bless him, bless him. Bless the Lord, oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Father, we bless your name. Father, we need your glory tonight. Father, we need your glory tonight. So we will never move until you lead the way. Lord, there'll be no decision until we know you're in. We will never move until. There'll be no decision until we know you're in. Somebody lift your voice with me. Said we will never move, say, we will never move until you lead the way. Father, there'll be no decision until we know you're in. We bless your name tonight. So we will never move. Hallelujah. There'll be no decision, say There'll be no Until we know you're in
glory. You are here in this place. Oh, and we are shepherd at your holy name. You are here, come and sing together. You are here. 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 In this place. In this place. And we worship. And we worship. We love you, Abba, left your voice. You are here, you are here, you are here.
bless his holy name bless his holy name come lift your voice bless his holy name Romano Semano Sasa We lift you higher Hey Be glorified Say Be glorified In the heaven Shout it Be glorified Be glorified In the earth Be glorified Be glorified in this hand, oh, shout it, Jesus, 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 he that glorified, he that glorified, oh, he that glorified, he that glorified. We fight. Come inside the Be that say, be that go. We fight. Be that glorify. Be that glorify. Be that glorify. Be that glorify. Come in and I'll wash with this song. Yeah, thou art sin. Yes, Why, yeah. Abba. Oh, my, yeah, da. Yes, you are. Yeah, you are. Yeah. can say. To the maker, clap your hands, everybody. Say, Come on, are you slapping your hands up to Jesus? Everybody, slap your hands up. Let's do it together. Come on up, one, two, one, two, three. Come on, say, Come on. Clap your hands. Come on, clap your hands. Everybody, clap your hands. Come on, everybody, clap your hands. Let's throw it with your handkerchief. Everybody, come on, say. Yes, we may be. What's up, baby? May be. 
Shout of praise in the house. If you are happy to be alive this day, give the Lord a shout and a resounding clap in the house this morning. Oh, let me hear the clap. Let me hear the shout. Let me hear the praise unto our God for giving us this blessed day. Hallelujah. Shall I please take our seats. We thank God for this blessed morning. We thank God for the opportunity to dance and to clap and to sing praises unto his name. Hallelujah. You are all welcome to the presence of God. I know where you are, you are watching us from this Eagles House Chapel. You are welcome to Eagles House Chapel. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now, what we are going to do this morning, we are going to do something new this morning. One thing that we need to know is that anytime you join something or you join an organization, you need to know why you join that thing. And you need to know the direction that the organization is going. Hallelujah. So that you can follow suit. So that when you are going to the right, you don't go to the left. And when we are going back, you don't go forward. Hallelujah. So this morning, we have our vision on the board. And we want every member to follow the vision. We want every member to know the vision of the church. So that you understand why we do what and why we do what we are doing. Hallelujah. So this morning, I would like us all to look at this vision and, and, and say and read it together. Hallelujah. So, this is the vision of Eagles House Chapel. So, one, two, let us read. Building a people with vision, power, and wisdom. Again. Hey, I'm not hearing you. Building. Hallelujah. We also have our mission. So, our mission also is developing people to full potential in Christ through preaching and teaching of the word of God. So, let's read it together again. I can't hear you. Developing people to full potential in Christ through preaching and teaching of the word of the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So, let us have this at the back of our mind. Hallelujah. We shall put our hands together for Jesus. We will take our first song ministration with a clap of hands. Let's welcome Sister Pamela to come and do this honest to give us a good song. Let's do better unto the Lord as she marks the podium. Oh, you can clap better unto the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Can you imagine how glorious it will be if we are standing in the presence of God, worshiping Him to eternity? Amen. Because He's the King of glory. He deserves all our worship and our intense. Amen. Mm -hmm. Just the word. We bow down and say you are God. Every man will bow down and say you
Of the living God this morning. Hallelujah. God bless you this morning. Can you please rise on your feet as we take our 10 minutes prayer? The Bible says in James chapter 5, 16, the B part. He said, The fervent prayer of the righteous availed much. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. I want us to pray this morning for souls for the church. Hallelujah. When you read Luke chapter 22, please give me John 13, 27 first, please. John 13, 27. He said, now, after the piece of bread, Satan entered him. Then Jesus said to him, what you do, do it quickly. Hallelujah. Amen. He said, after the bread was deep in the, uh, in the sauce, Satan entered into, uh, into Judas. We are praying this morning that anything that the devil has planted in this church or in the heart of man, we are praying concerning the souls of the house, concerning our papa, we are praying this morning that may they backfire in the name of Jesus. Amen. May their plans never stand in the name of Jesus. Amen. Any plantings, anything the devil has planted in this church, 
around our father, around his ministry, and is blocking souls from not entering into the church. We are praying this morning. Let that power cut fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. This, morning, this morning, any power, any, power, any, satanic, any satanic arrangement, arrangement around, around our, church, our church, around, around our, father, our Father, that is blocking <laughs> souls <laughs> from entering entry into your sanctuary. Into sanctuary. We come against thee by, by the fire of the Holy Ghost. Oh, the Holy Ghost. I want to open up to pray this morning. Come against any power. Come against any forces that fight against the souls of this church. That fight against the set man of God. That fight against our Father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We come against. We come against. We come against. We come against any forces. We come against against any blockade in the name of Jesus. We come against any blockade. We come against let it backfire. Let it backfire. Let it backfire. Let it backfire. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. 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 Anyone among us that Satan has desired to shift to shift to pull. From the, church. from the church, let that agenda, let that agenda cut, fire. cut fire. When we read Luke chapter 22, verse 31, the Bible said, And the Lord said, Simon, Simon, indeed, Satan has asked for you that he may shift or shift you as feet. But I have prayed for thee. It means there was a prayer that was prayed for Peter, that he was no move from his position. Hallelujah. Anybody in this church that the devil has targeted, that want to pull or move the person from this church, we are praying or we are lifting prayer for that individual, or we are lifting prayer for ourselves this morning, that if the Lord has ordained us to be in this church, may nothing move us. Hallelujah. Amen. May nothing move us. Hallelujah. Amen. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. This morning, this morning as we lift up, as we lift up our, hands, our hands, we pray, we pray the, Lord, the Lord, anyone, anyone the devil, the devil have set has set eyes, eyes upon. upon. This, morning, this morning, we come against their plans. plans. We come against we come again in the name, the Bible said that when Samson was going to Timna, all of a sudden, a lion appeared. Hallelujah. We are praying this morning that may the forces that will suddenly come and attack the members of the church, may their forces be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Amen. It says suddenly a lion appeared. Hallelujah. Any force that will come to attack us, we come against it in the name of Jesus. We come against it in the name of Jesus. We come against it in the name of Jesus. Open up begin to pray this morning that any force, Shatter any spirit that will come to attack us suddenly, suddenly, may their words by fire, may it never hold in the name of Jesus. Labrasetei, any sudden attack be destroyed. Any sudden attack be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Destroy. Be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Verse 16, It's a commit your, commit your works to the Lord. We are committing our works this morning unto the living God this morning. That may the Lord save our businesses. This week, this year, into the next year, may the Lord save our businesses. May we never run lost in the name of Jesus. But may our business profit. May our business see increase in the name of Jesus. Open my begin to pray this morning. That may profit come into your life. May the Lord protect your business. May the Lord protect you and your business. 
Jesus. May you never run long in the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Any day of trouble marked, marked. Marked, marked, marked for the destruction, for the destruction of, your family, of your family, of my family, of, my family, of, the, church. of the church. We come against, we come against, we come against that destruction in the, in the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. This morning, this morning, any misfortune, any misfortune, any misfortune, any misfortune, any misinformation. Any miss, any miss, information in connection against, against our father, our father against, against the ministry, the ministry against, against the souls, souls against, against the souls. The souls. We, come against, we come against, we come against, we come against the works the of, the of the enemy that are blocking, that are blocking, that are blocking, that are blocking souls, souls through, through misinformation, misinformation against the church. Against the church. Lift up your voice, begin to pray this morning against the enemy. Misinformation against our Father that is blocking souls from entering the church. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Let every satanic strategy designed to destroy our Father be terminated. In the name of any demonic strategy that have taken to terminate the ministry of our father we are coming against it in the name of jesus open up to pray this morning pray and come against any satanic strategy any satanic destruction against our father against his ministry Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lord, save our Father from the name, from the enemies, and the assignment, and the assignment against our Father. We are praying against that. May those assignments backfire in the name of Jesus. Open to pray this morning. The media assignment of the enemy concerning our Father be destroyed in the name of Jesus. We come against any demonic assignment against our Father. In the name of Jesus. Psalm 27 verse 5. He said, for in the time of trouble, he shall hide him in his pavilion in the secret place of his temple. We are praying this morning that may the Lord hide our father from his enemies. Hallelujah. Amen. When they are looking for him, they will not find him. But what? Find the blood. May the Lord hide him. Hallelujah. Amen. Say in the name of Jesus, name of may, Jesus. Our father, may our father, may our father, may our father never, be never be exposed to his enemies, to his enemies. In, the in the name of Jesus. Of Jesus. Oh, we're going to pray this morning. We hid our father in the blood of Jesus. We hid him in the blood. Say in the name of Jesus. This morning, anyone who is asking information to destroy our Father, may their words never stand. We come against, we come against any questioning that will cause our Father never to rise. We come against those forces. Forces, forces. In, the name in the name of Jesus. Of Jesus. God bless you.
God, if you are blessed by the hymn now, lift your voice and clap unto Jesus. Make a joyfulness unto Jesus. Hallelujah. We thank God for another opportunity to test the Lord with our substance. And let us to read a scripture from the book of 2 Corinthians chapter 9, verse 6 to 7. 2 Corinthians chapter 9, verse 6 to 7. Amen. He said, test me and see if I will not open the windows of heaven. So the criteria for opening of the heavens is to test the Lord. He said, but this I say, he who sows sparingly will also reap sparingly. But he who sows bountifully will also reap bountifully. Verse 7. It says, so let each one give us a purposes in his heart, not grudgingly or of necessity. For God loves a cheerful giver. One of the things we should be very mindful of is not we giving, but how we give. We shouldn't approach the throne of God with with, with grudging heart, as if we've been forced to give, we approach the throne of God with joy. One thing that we observe in the church is that we cannot approach the throne with dancing and with laughter, with smile on our face. That's one of the things that God looks at to also open the heavens upon us. So as you are giving, I, I'm trying to, I'm, I'd like to uh, ask you and plead with you to come to the throne of God with some joy, with some dancing as they are singing. Come as if you are giving, you are giving with, uh, with a purposeful heart. You are giving from within. You are prepared to give unto God, not because you've been asked to give. Hallelujah. With this word, I want us to be on our feet and prepare our offering. Activate that joy in our heart. Activate that smile on our face. You, you don't give to your wife or your girlfriend with, with a frown face. You or she will not receive. The same way, let's approach with God. Approach God with some excitement, with some joy that we are giving back to you, Father, what you have given to us. If it's even one city, give with joy that I'm also being able to give back unto my God. Let's prepare our heart as we give. Let's receive uh, the song from the ministers. Go 
Sumba Sumba, what you may have a one, what you may have a sea, some such an instant. Come on, you know, to Rasa, and I will go to Yami. I tell what you must saw, and to make us so much more. Hey, let me know me, what you can say, let me know me. the form of offering clap unto Jesus. Hallelujah. Uh, the, our online viewers are not left out. You can also connect with your offering through any of the mediums on the platform. Your life will never be the same. Shall we pray? Father, we present our offering before the throne. May it be acceptable on our side. As you have promised, O oh God, in your word, open the heavens upon us this week. Let us see your goodness. Let us walk in divine miracles. Give us testimonies, O oh God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let's put our hands together for Jesus. Shall please take our seats. It's time for us to take our book with you, but before then, I want us to look at something that is very important in the church, our core value that is in the church. We have our core values. When those of us who have been to SS University, you realize that there are some, some subjects, they are core subjects. It means that so long as you are in that stage, you do that subject. Hallelujah. So long as you are in Eagle South Chapel, you must follow these core values. These core values must be part and parcel of you. Hallelujah. So it's on the board. So I want us to read it together. Hallelujah. So the E stands for what? Through discipleship. And then the A stands for what? Associating together through fellowship. And G, glorifying God through worship. And then L, leading sinners to Christ through evangel. And then the E stands for edifying one another through service. And then the S stands for what? Spiritual advancement through prayer and the word of God. So let us have these core values at the back of our minds. And let us be involved in these core values and make sure it's part of our lives. So long as you are an eagle service, so long as you are a member of the eagle, these core values must always be with you. So that you, don't, you, go, you move according to the way the vision is moving. Hallelujah. With a clap of, clap of let's welcome Joyce to come and give us the book review. Let's do it better unto the Lord. If you have your books, you can also bring it out and read, read along. Hallelujah. Good morning, everyone. So today, we draw the curtains on the book, The Wayward Son. So please, if you have your book, kindly open to the last Hello. page. If you have the book, rise. Let me see. Ushers, take the books around. Buy it now. Let me see those who came with your books. Okay. Usher, if you go to any worker who has it, let it buy again. Take it around and sell it now before the book starts. The MC don't even have some. Go ahead and give it to me. Or should I go and give the MC? It's a wrong MC. Let him buy it now. Take money from him. Let him buy it for 50 cities. Take it from him. Take your seat. Read now. 
Okay, so the, um, this is chapter 7, the conclusion of the book. And these are the words or the prayers of our Father for reading the book. I pray that God will open the eyes of your understanding on this subject matter of spiritual sonship and fatherhood. May you continue to stay the course, stay true to your father, and receive a double portion of divine blessings for greater works in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Now, please place your right hand on your head and prayerfully respond to each of the declarations with an amen. Now, I stand in the gap as a prophet of the Almighty Father, and I make the following declarations over your life. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I decree and declare that you shall be an exemplary son and walk in great wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of the times. The hand of the Father will be upon you and grant you peace on every side. May every area of your life experience the peace of God. Your life shall be an expression of goodness and grace of all the days of your lives. God's favor and mercy shall be your companion of all the days of your life. Help will come to you from every part of the world, both from the people you know and the ones you do not know in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Peace like rivers are flowing into your life, family, and business in the name of Jesus Christ. You shall not be short of great and mighty things in your life. The Lord shall decorate your life. The comfort of God surrounds you all the days of your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Every challenge become a stepping stone for you. Walk in divine stability. The angels of God are released into every activity concerning your life. Your life is filled with testimony of goodness and greatness. By the reason of what the Lord will do in your life, many shall turn unto him in the name of Jesus. There is an end, and your expectations shall not be cut short. Your expectations shall not be supplanted. Everything that the mouth of the Lord has spoken shall come to pass in your life. You shall regain everything you have lost. You shall recover everything that Satan has stolen. Devourers are rebuked for your sake in the name of Jesus Christ. The power of God shall do wonders without numbers in your life. The days of difficulties are over. The rest of your life shall be spent in greatness and the glory of God. Prosperity without limit is your portion. Let there be a way where there is no way. Let there be an open door in impossible places. Let a miracle happen without a stoppage in the name of Jesus Christ. Everything that has become a long-standing problem is taken off by the hand of God in the name of Jesus Christ. You are strengthened by the hand of God to have good success and earn prosperity in the name of Jesus Christ. Every existing association not set up by God which has been slowing down the pace of your success scatter now in the name of Jesus. Every arrow of the wicked one marshaled against you are set ablaze in the name of Jesus. So as we draw the curtains on this book, please remember, who is your spiritual father? How well have you bonded with him? How well have you submitted to him? Thank you very much. Hallelujah. Oh, come on, put your hands together for Jesus. Oh, your clapping is very weak. Do it better to Jesus. Somebody wave your hands to Jesus. Come on, go ahead and wave your hands to Jesus. Who loves me? 
deeply the way that you do. Jesus, you've been true to me since I met you. Promise me you never leave. Ever since you stood by my side, my one and only God, you're my everything. God over everything. Continue you more. My one and only God, you're my everything. Everybody wave your hands to the Lord.
It's just by the grace of God. Every time you go to bed and you wake up, it's a sign of grace. As your life this morning, I want to lift your two hands. There is something that money cannot buy. Money cannot buy life. That's why nobody can sell life. You can pay for life. You can pay for your breath. You can pay for it. And no man can give you. It's only God that can give you life. So if you have come before that God, and you have life, life is more than money. Some have money. I have no life. They are weak. They are lying down. But the money cannot save them. But if this body has strength, strength, and you are life. Is about the grace of God. You lift your hands and tell the Lord He deserves the praise. Lift your voice and bless the Lord. David said, I will bless the Lord at all times. At all times. I want to hear your voice. Shut, shut, shut. And bless him. Tell him that you love him. He deserves a praise. Record of all Sadabadi we do it here every Sunday. We give our Thanksgiving offering as a sign of Thanksgiving throughout the week. It's not compulsory. But if only you want to thank God for something, God has kept you alive. Not only you, but your family. We started the year with a lot of people. But they are no more. Tell them, 
as we, we, we started a year with a lot of people but there are no more so so if you are alive this morning it's just by the grace of God take that money that thanksgiving offering this one no go will go around all of us must visit the altar and tell the Lord that we thank him yes, so if you have yours once you are singing you walk and drop it on the altar yes, you can sing a blessing
will send you soon. Uh, stop it. I won't stop it. What's it? What's it? I know it. I know it. Look around and tell somebody you are welcome this morning, the house of the Lord. I tell him or her that it's good you came this morning. Give the person a high five and tell him or her God will bless you before you leave here this morning. God will bless you. Amen. Can you take your seat? Welcome, my son. We'll be coming back tonight. Yes, sir. But and then you brave you for a very important service. Tonight we'll be taking testimonies also. And then you brave. Yes, sir. Tonight is reversing or the mystery behind cases. At the time is five. So let's try and maintain the time so I can have more time and teach you how you pray more. I want to close at least 745, 8 o'clock here out of this place. So I will teach you very deep things about cases. And you know that every case can be reversed. Every case can be broken. So tonight, please come on time. Don't come alone. Come with your family. So that will work on you. Tonight, I will do a lot of ministrations. Lay hands on people and speak into their lives. Now, We called for a meeting to the Navrungo. And a few people came. Where is the message? Those who not come to the meeting. The Navrungo, you will not go. If you call for a meeting, you don't come. You won't go to the Navrungo. If you call for the meeting, and you don't come. If you don't join the prayer meetings, if you don't join what you are doing, son, you won't go to the Navrongo. When the time comes, you won't come and walk here and say, I'm going to Navrongo. You won't go. Last week, they didn't come to the meeting. They are waiting for three days to Navrongo. And they will come around and say, We are going. At least this, we have enough workers there. So if you don't go, I will go and come. The team that traveled with us, if you know you are going to Navrongo, Wednesday be in the service. Right after the service, we will have our meeting. This week, we have few weeks to the to Navrongo. Few weeks. So please, if you know you are going with us, prepare your money too. What you have, prepare. All those who pick the envelopes for the missions. If you have yours, you can drop it and help the missions. Now, the ushers, all those you give the books to, make sure you take them, otherwise I'll take it from you. 
those who pick the books today, anybody who've given the books, make sure you otherwise the ushers have the books. I will take it from you after service. Now, this morning service is in two sections. I will speak for few, like less than 10 minutes. We will do some practical. And I, I come to the main service that we close. We are believing God that before he left you out of this place. So give me your attention for a few minutes. Last week, I spoke on the topic, you are sent. You are sent. You are sent. The core values of this church, put on the screen for me, the El Eagles. I'll pick that one to do something. Put on the screen for me. The core values of the church. If you go to the school, they say core values or core subject, which means everybody must do it. It's something that everybody must do it. No matter what you want, it's something you have to do. Now, the E stands for equipping the saints through discipleship. That's the eagle's meaning. So, when someone tells you, why do you go to the house chapel? You should know all these things. A, the, to associate together through fellowship. The G means glorifying God through worship. So, discipleship, fellowship, worship. The L means leading sinners to Christ through evangelism. And evangelism is a soul winning. So, so evangelism is not something for only Ege House Chapel. Uh, you must put in your mind that when you go in soul, you are not bringing a soul to a church. You are bringing a soul into a kingdom. When the witches are winning souls, in their mind, they are pulling you into the kingdom of darkness. So, soul winning is not winning soul into your church. In the mind of God, it's not church. In the mind of God, it's kingdom. John said, when I saw the vision in heaven, I saw no temple. So it's not about the church. It's about the kingdom. So when you win a soul, you are not winning a soul into a church. The person have entered into a church. But the person have entered into a kingdom. That's why Christianity, we have confused. Baptists think they are better than Methodists. Presbyterian, they are better than this. Charismatic, they are better. We are confused. It's not about the church. It's about the kingdom. That's why Christians are not together. Mind church. Church. It's not church. It's kingdom. If you are winning so, you are winning so into the kingdom. Not a church. Not a church. It's about a kingdom. Look out to the better. Not the church. It's about a kingdom. So it's about a kingdom. So I say you are saint. Not only the pastor, but whoever you are, God has sent you. I spoke a lot last week about John chapter 20, verse 21, 22. I'm praying for only five minutes and we'll do some practicals. Tonight, you have to come and hear some powerful mysteries. John 20, 21, 22. And Jesus said to them, Peace be unto you. As the Father has sent me, I also send you. So you are sent. The Father has sent me. And me too, I'm sending you. So John chapter 9, 1 day, John chapter 9, one day, Jesus Christ was moving about. And Jesus met a blind man from Beth. And the disciples said to whose sin have made this man blind? 
Is this son of the father of the mother? And he said, No one I've seen. And I've seen. And also, we'll be around your body. Verse number four. Take my picture from there and put the scripture there. Put the picture too much. Take my picture and put the scripture boldly. Work. The works of him who sent me. If someone is sitting beside you, so be to one chair. The person is closer to you. If I cry the hold the hands. So I mean, and tell the person we must work the works of him who sent us. 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 You think you were sent on the earth to come and buy a car and die? Would you say yes, Mama? But we have to say but talk car the work. You think you were sent to build houses and die? And I say yes, Mama. I say but I never see fear in it. That's why he sent you here. And you think yes, Mama? Why not? I must work the works of him who sent me. While it is day, the night is coming. When no one can work. A time is coming. You will desire to preach the gospel. You will not get. A time is coming. You will desire somebody will call you. Come to church. But I'm sorry, nobody will call oh, you. Frau. A time is coming. Bre, you will desire oh, that someone will call you. So be frau. Where are you? Oh, why? Nobody will call oh, you. Frau. He said, I must work. Oh, say, oh, say, me, yeah, the works of him. Yeah, oh, so, man. There are some of us, the way we kill ourselves for our work, Emma, yeah, juma, yeah, yeah. we don't kill ourselves for yeah, the work of God. Emma, yeah, yeah, juma. Most of us here, we are here because of our selfish gain. Some have come here because their marriage has delayed. Some are looking for me because they want me to lay hands on them. The problem is so. They will talk to me and go. Some are looking for me because they want Some people will pursue me, call me, and I see if I own them. Not because they want to be called, they want something from me. So selfish mental. Most of you are here because of the contract. So there's nothing about you that connect to the kingdom. It's about yourself. Some are here because your people are dying. You don't want to die. So we are serving God with selfish mentality. Pastor, pray for me. Oh, give me a contract. If the money comes, what will you use the money for? The last contract you had. You know how you spend the money. So I must work the works of him who sent me. While it is day, the night is coming. A time is coming. You can work again. A time is coming. You would desire somebody to knock at your door to preach the gospel. You will not get it. A time is coming. All social media thing will break. You know, be in your house and be watching online. A time is coming. Nobody will come to you and say, Yeah, go to church. You will desire to work for me. Do not get it. Today have the strength. Today have the energy. Today you can stand on a high head. You can walk about. Use your energy to work for God. Because one day you will go and give report. Not the amount of money you have in your account. Not the amount of houses you have built. If I lie down on my bed, the car, the money, the house, I, my problem is not there. Not the problem is not that. And yet, how then I join it? No, no. I'm worried. It's about the kingdom. It's about the kingdom. Some of us, you are worried in life. Because of material things. This morning, I came to tell you. 
God of Sinti. Have you obeyed the calling? Of Reno Udiso. Mark chapter 16. Verse 15. We'll do some podcasts right now. And he said to them, Go. Most of you. The word go. So now, you are standing. Go is a command. Since the word, the Lord said, Go! You've not even gone. Even in your office, you've not gone. Even in your school, you've not gone. Are you here today? Yeah. I saw you are here. Yes. <laughs> the first time I saw dollars. A bread camp up home, a brochure, sika dollars. I was less than fifteen years. Now on the few do no po. I was preaching at the saloon. Now okay, I was saloon. First, I saw dollars. Not in a church. I was going from saloon to saloon. House to house. Preaching the gospel. When you die today, what will follow you? It's not your hairstyle. It's not how beautiful you are. It's the work you have worked for the kingdom. Let no one deceive you. And when you die, finish. Don't mind them. If you want to move that, and the one who is saying that on wood, we don't die twice. You go and pray. Go into the well. Don't go. Some of us, you move. The most powerful life is I'm traveling to go and have fun. I've been to Canada for the past 13, 14 years. I don't know the Niagara Falls. The CN Tower, I'll be the only ones. And I'll be to by force. I didn't go for vacation. I went for ministry. I've been to London for the past 16 years. Where the palaces have not been there. People go there and take pictures. Don't you know? That's why I went there. And you know, call, huh? I can travel, be in a hotel, preach. I will be there uh, back to Ghana. Get me to Ghana, baby. I will come see you. Eh ho? Any story for you? Any story for you? We are going to Some of you, you be. Humanity is more important to you than divinity. Enjoy life. It's more important to you than the service of God. The time will come. That certificate you are fighting over. That master's and PAD. When you die, you live somewhere. It will not enter your grave. It will not enter your grave. Go into the well. You are sitting down looking at my face. Go. 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 My outreach, my show winning, bless my parents. When I was going, my father didn't pay my school fees. So somebody I met preaching. Held my hands to the house. I'll pay your son's school fees. So young, I went out. If you, if you give God your best, you take care of your future. Go into the Some of you, your problem, God is not part of your problem. You will be, yeah, how they ready and come who cry. No wonder people will call to come to church and for say, money. I had a story yesterday Papa, tia, that somebody. somebody
Ask the one, what are you doing about the calling? So he said, Ofreno, then I will have Ofreno. Then I will have Ofreno. I'm talking to you, look at your neighbor and say it. Respond the first. Then I will have Ofreno. The last scripture, they will do some particles. The duty, write this one, the duty. Or the duty for men, or the duty for your salvation is to engage in aggressive evangelism. You are an agent of transformation. So if you are an agent an agent of transformation, you are God have sent you to evangelize. That is your calling. And I know friend. Luke 14, 23. So the master called for a party, called for a dinner. And those who invited didn't come. Can you leave the, uh, uh, the Rilla Banner for me? Leave it here. This year, God gave us an assignment. An assignment is a year of rescue. In the rescue, there is salvation. There is prosperity, there is good. This all salvation package. If God says we should rescue, we have to rescue. We must become agent of transformation. We must become agent of transformation. We must become agent of transformation. You don't think about God. What do you think about you? It's not part of your program. It's not part of your agenda. His church is not part of your plans. His assignment is not part of your plans. You don't care about what God is saying. You want him to care about you. No. 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 Now I have gone to a level in life I don't open my mouth when I think about it. God answers. I'm telling you, that's a level I'm telling you. Anything that bothers me, and I lie down, and I think about it, God answers. Now 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 I God answers. Now I think about it, 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 God so I don't open most of it. We be one of some boy. Because I command it here. Some are here. If God bless you, we have you. We have you. I buy now one name. We go be take with some small girl. Oh, but it took pie. What's that? Eh. No, it's the cat too. We say we watch though. What's that? All those who are smiling, you are suspects. <laughs> <laughs> Clap for yourself. <laughs> well, it's a Some of you are here. You may be a Because your boyfriend fought you yesterday. Since I don't know, plan a point. You have nobody to talk to. And they will be an end of bonk. So I've got to put your bed on us. What do I just want? I bet she is so. If your boyfriend is nice with you by this time, we should let them watch your Nigerian movie. <laughs> Give someone a high five. Tell the person we have to rescue. You. So the master said to the servant, Go out. Hold someone to tell the person, Go out. Into the highways. To the hedges. And compel them to come here that my house may be full. Rise on your feet. You know our problem? 
No problem. We think one has not called us. No problem. We are too full of ourselves. Most of you who feel who say who feel who say you can't. Some of you feel yourself too much. To a sense, you don't even want to even talk to somebody about Christ. It's a demon. It's a demon. It's a spirit. Because one day, Sanse, when bro. you die, so, a foolish man will see you naked at the mortuary. Yes, yes, yes. 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 Yes, yes, all those are looking at me. Yeah, you have a pain in a. You are sitting down here with your big shoes and your big jeans. And your big dresses. No, looking big dresses. Looking at me. You have come here. Wabaha. Without a suit. You have failed. With Diego. You check a bath. I'm sorry. No, be on team me boy. You didn't. When you check a crowd to be back, not be in your car. You have failed. All of you are here looking at me. You, you can even start a cell meeting. In your house, of a Bible school, people are lawyers are now working for God. People are doctors are working for God. People are professors. Ukraine, I'm so feeling that if you didn't hear. As I'm speaking now, all those are frowning their face. You are all demonic agents. So laugh. If I'm preaching the gospel of salvation, so and you frown your face, I will add the prayer to this minute. I'll leave the sword over you. I'll leave the sword over you. The Father, all those who frown their face, let the sword of the Lord arise and give them long life. Give with a clap offering. But we'll sell myself already. So right now, Cecilia, I'm about to send you out. Anybody you meet, put the person to church. Don't ask where you're going. Say, pull him to church. That's why I say, wear casual. Wear casual. Wear casual. Wear casual. Now, if you go out so, okay, and you don't come back again, no, I'm, I'm a swat. hear me. See, you know. Hear what I will say. You've left a gap in your life nobody can erase. It's 10 o'clock. By 10 30, we are all here. Everybody must come. Uh, if the person is wearing shorts, if the person is even wearing support, I bring the person here. I have shorts in my room. Do you understand me? If the person is bath, stand by the bathhouse. Time to reduce the soup. You will pass here. Some are now coming. Yeah. So we are all going out to win the soup. For only 30 minutes. So you go out and you we are I'm not let me give a scripture. John chapter John chapter Luke chapter 19 verse 41. Put a script for me. I'm not joking. I'm very serious. What I'm talking to is a plan with God and the Holy Ghost. And yet, Luke 19. Is it Luke 19? Luke 19, verse 41. Yeah, 21, 41. They want to have four and two in their back home. Now, as they drew near, he saw the city and wept over it. They fought once. They fought once. I also open a how. He wants his house to be full. 
When he drew near the city, then he saw Jerusalem, he started crying. Some of us, if God look at us and look at our lifestyle, he cries. Is it the lady I saved? Is it a young man I die for? If you look at our, our nation and see the way we are behaving, and he wept over the city. Don't let God cry over you. Most of you, your greatest. Do you know how marriages break? Let me tell you. Most marriages break because of selfish interests. Why are you living? Because the man does not make me happy. Why they make you? Who should make you happy? You went to marriage for a man to make you happy. Who will not be happy in life? You must go with the intention I'm going to make the part that person happy. The man doesn't give me attention. You give the person attention. Selfishness is breaking marriages. Selfishness is breaking Christians. Have the heart for the work of God. Have the heart to work for God. Some are here, you've won so already, you win again. So later two months, we are praying, we are going out. That you will come back. When you will be out there, but that's if you are sorry. Anywhere you meet somebody, miss a P, you will miss somebody. Tell them that. Let's go to church. Together. No chatting. No friendship. You are going out to win souls. If I say the name of Jesus. Clap and shine the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As we move out. As we move out. Let the Holy Ghost. Let the Holy Ghost. Be with us. Be with us. Lead us. Lead us. People, you see a lot of young people drinking, smoking, playing football, doing wrong things. The church of God you must arise and do something for the kingdom. That is my passion for God. I can empty my account for the kingdom. I don't, I don't feel it. I will not empty my account for you. 